day, this aerial inspiration leads us once again on a new path. Aiming higher inspires reinvention. Uh, thank you so much to all of you. Thank you, Luca, and welcome. And here you are. Here's the new Rafale. Now, uh, before I describe you, describe the new Renault Rafale to you, I'd like to take you back to 2020. We started off with a blank slate for the creation of this new Renault brand uh, flagship. It is based on the CMFCD platform, but it has a completely original silhouette and a design and a formal language that evolves into totally new codes. Well, first of all, the shape is that of an SUV coupe to which we have given the right fundamentals. First of all, its width, 1 meter, one meter 86, a long bonnet with a vertical front face, large wheels, and of course, a fastback rear with a highly sculpted, finely honed rear end that conveys the efficiency of this new silhouette. The front end really does reveal a very strong personality, and we've paid great attention to every detail. Now, the daytime running lights, like on the new Clio, are inspired by the geometry of the logo, and they are a direct reference to the brand. The modules in the in the headlights have also been designed in an ultra technological spirit that with a color effect that you can that you can see depending on where you're sitting in the hall giving the nouveau rafale a very lively look the radiator grille hides a blue background which is revealed in a color shaded pat pattern also inspired by the Renault diamond and you can see this beautifully when the car is on the move so these few elements of the front end will create a magical effect on our street and it's with such ideas, this great attention to detail, that we've created a vehicle that stands out. So on the sides, we've sought to protect, project a dynamic and elegant spirit with very strong character lines. The overall dynamic of the silhouette is very eye-catching, and it's very it's balanced by two lines, a small crease on the rear pillar, and the sculpted lines at the bottom of the doors, and the result is a very well balanced volume that closes in at the rear, a bit like the prestigious aircraft that surround us in this air show today. Now, thanks to its extended wheelbase of 2.74 meters, New Rafale offers remarkable interior roominess for an SUV coupe. On board, we have two major innovations, an ingenious rear armrest uh, and that offers connectivity charging facilities and a proper support for smartphones and tablets as you just as if you were in business class the second innovation is the transparent panoramic sunroof a solar bay and this really does add a magical quality to the interior with its highly graphic and very fluid animation in segments as it opens and closes and the interior also features the open R system which you've probably seen but it's been updated with a new enriched graphic theme and a new, rather uh, spectacular welcome sequence. In terms of ambience, the Esprit Alpine trim achieves a high level of sophistication with mineral decor, such as slate, very meticulous uh, tailoring, very three colors uh, overstitching, and the famous A for Alpine in the backrest of the front seats, which light up and come to life during the vehicle's exterior welcome sequence. And of course, we've used eco-responsible materials, like the upholstery, for example, that's made for 61% uh, recycled Alcantara. All these innovations are designed to make the car a pleasure to use, as well as all the de details I mentioned about the exterior, the creativity and the care that we've put into the experience our customers will enjoy every day. It is all of this that makes a difference, and this, I'm sure, is what will make the Nouveau Rafale 
such a success. I'm going to give the floor now to Mathieu Galipo, who is our product director for the C&D segments, and who's going to be talking to you about driving pleasure on board the new Renault Rafale. Thank you very much for your time. Bonjour à tous. Hello, everyone. Thank you very much, Gilles. So you can see this is not just a feast for the eyes, this Rafale. It's also a huge pleasure to drive. So the new Rafale is built on the, uh, on the Alliance's CMFCD platform. It offers exceptional technological content in terms of running gear, powertrains, and electronic equipment. For its commercial launch, scheduled for Q2 2024, the Rafale will initially be fitted with the 200 BHP E-Tech full hybrid engine. This is the engine that was uh, launched on Austral, and it's already renowned for its record efficiency. On the Rafale, this 200 BHP engine will have a fuel consumption of just 4.7 liters per 100 kilometers. And that means you can have a range of 1,100 kilometers on just one tank full. Under the bonnet, however, we have another surprise in store. We are preparing a new version of the E-Tech hybrid engine. It's a version clearly dedicated to driving pleasure and high performance. First of all, the power, it's an E-Tex, but it will be a 300 BHP engine. The addition of an extra electric motor on the rear axle will make Rafale into a four-wheel drive SUV coupe. Now I'd like to talk to you a little more about the chassis. Driving pleasure is enhanced by a multi-link rear suspension. This is coupled up with the la latest evolution of the four-control advanced four-wheel steer system. It makes the car as maneuverable as a city car at low speeds with a turning circle of a little over 10, 10 meters, and it also gives the Rafale exceptional agility and dynamism at higher speeds. Another strong point of Rafale is its open R link connected multimedia system. Rafale adopts a new evolution of this system, although it's already the most intuitive and one of the most powerful on the market, with Google Automotive Services directly embedded into it. Its cockpit benefits from the very modern technology of the double screen open R system with its revamped graphics. Finally, I'd like to tell you about an innovation of which we are especially proud. It's a new technology of op opacifying technology for new sunroofs called Solar Bay. It's really spectacular. We developed this uh, technology with our partner Saint Gobain. This is a new generation glass roof using Ampli Sky technology based on a liquid crystal polymer film. It can be made opaque or transparent by just voice command, voice control via the Google Assistant interface, and the wow effect is guaranteed. In short, and actually, this is the kind of application that you can find on uh, av in aviation. And so, in short, it's quite clear that driving pleasure is the number one priority of our new SUV coupe, but it never comes at the expense of the passengers who are pampered in terms of space and equipment in the great tradition of Renault's lifestyle cars. Finally, if I had to sum up Renault Rafale in one word, it's excellence. It's all of Renault's technological excellence.